25 silver coins. That was John's inheritance after the death of his dear old father. With no reason to stay home any longer, John decided it was time to venture out and see something of the world. Is that you? You'll see this here princess, son. Do I ever? She's beautiful. Well, son, you play your cards right, and you've a fair chance of becoming her husband. <laughs> oh, now I know I'm dreaming. That's my old dad. Always kidding. Oh. <laughs> Give me that. Huh? Come on. Huh? Hey. <gasps> Leave him alone, you two. What's it to you, boy? The deceased here owed us money. So. Whatever we find on him is ours. See? So you mind your own business, boy, or else. <sighs> Look, 25 pieces of silver. It's all I've got. Now, please. <laughs> <laughs> Pleasure doing business with you, boy. Just leave this poor soul alone, will you? <laughs> <laughs> Rest in peace, my friend, whoever you are. And so, John went on his way, penniless now, but much richer than before, for knowing he had done the right thing. Huh? Well, hello there, John. How do you know my name? Ah, call it a lucky guess. So, huh? where are we headed to, John? If you don't mind me tagging along, that is. Well, I'm really not sure you'd want a travelling companion as poor as me, friend. Hmm. Poor, you say? And hungry, too, I'll warrant. Huh? Listen. You want to go my way? You be my guest. Mm. So what should I call you, friend? Huh? Hmm. I'm sure I used to have a name. But do you know, I'll be blowed if I can recall what it is. Dessert? Oh, yum. When John was little, his parents had always told him not to talk to strangers. But John was all grown up now and alone in the world. <laughs> and there was something about this most peculiar gentleman which made him feel he could trust him. 
A beautiful princess. And you're sure it was your father? Well, if it was in a dream, it must be true. Trust me, I know these things. Oh. Oh. oh! What is it? What's wrong? My leg. It's broken. Quick, John, my bag. Oh! What have you got in there? Thanks, John. Now, let's see what we can do for you, eh? Huh? All right. See if you can walk on that now. our way around these parts. Hmm. Well, I never. A funnel. Just what I've always wanted. <laughs> that was kind of your friend. Pretending to value that old funnel so much. Who says I was pretending? Too? I'd gladly give you all my takings in return. And tomorrow's too. Hang on to your money, Puppet Master. But I do like the look of that sword of yours. Beautiful swan. Isn't that sad? I find everything as beautiful and as sad as everything else these days. What are you doing? Take this poor swan's wings, for instance. You never know when swan wings might come in handy. <laughs> <laughs> 